measles outbreak in central Ohio ends after 85 cases, all among children who weren't fully vaccinated. A measles outbreak in central Ohio that sickened 85 children has been declared over, officials at Columbus Public Health announced Sunday. None of the children died, but 36 were hospitalized. Lisa Marie Presley felt protected during COVID, vulnerable pre-Golden Globes. Lisa Marie Presley could not handle the stress leading up to the Golden Globes, because she had become used to feeling anonymous during COVID, and felt fully exposed during the roll-up to the Golden Globes. Sources tell TMZ. How to watch the 2023 Grammy Awards, Time, Channels and more. The biggest night in music is here with the 65th Grammy Awards on Sunday. Koch Network to oppose Trump in primary after sitting out recent cycles. The return of one of the biggest spenders in U.S. politics to the presidential primary field poses a direct challenge to the former president's comeback bid. Flexing his wins and eyeing a second term, Biden will lay out contrasts with GOP in State of the Union. The annual speech will hit an array of issues, but mainly will reflect the political reality of a divided Congress. Pope Mass in South Sudan. Pontiff urges people to reject venom of hatred. On the last day of his visit, throngs of South Sudanese filled John Garong Mausoleum to greet him. Horoscope for the week of February 5, 2023, Weekly Horoscope. Everything you need to know for the upcoming week. Upbeat economic data keep investors on edge about Fed. After a strong jobs report, traders are betting the Fed might raise interest rates two more times this year. Mount Washington experiences record-setting wind chill. Boston, AP. The Arctic air that descended on the northeast on Saturday brought dangerously cold sub-zero temperatures and wind chills to the region, including a record-setting wind chill of minus 108 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 78 C, on the summit of Mount Wah. 